We're going to get into the water here, and we have our anchor line down to the boiler area. So once we've got our buoyancy set out, make sure everybody's uh, happy on the surface. We're going to descend down the anchor line slowly. Once we get down to the bottom, we're going to clip in with the reel. And then from there, we're going to head out around the wreck and explore. We're looking for newly revealed stashes of ammunition. Yeah. So after the winter, after these North Atlantic storms, stuff gets turned over every year. So you're dead right, John. We might see a new exposed stash of this ordnance now. All right, will you and Kayla get sorted out? Bob and I will follow you with the cameras. Copy that. Sounds good. Let's get wet or let's stay dry. <laughs> As we dive in, the waves at the surface are fairly small. Typically, a sign that the water at depth is also calm. And that's good news as we start our descent. But this dive could last up to an hour, and in the North Atlantic, things can change fast. Divers at the bottom, what kind of visibility do you have? 